Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, and today, it, today, <laughs> it is Flat Top Friday, and Woo! we're also going to have another guest today. It's Mr. Jack Ryan Sullivan. Hey! hey. What's up, Jack? What's up? How you doing? Good. We got a cool guitar today. It's pretty weird. That Jack it? knows all about, so let's get to it. Yeah, they, uh, they like to get a hold of me here and get me involved when it's the weird stuff that only I am weird enough to talk about. <laughs> so... Anyway, this is a cool guitar, um, as they all are. You ever, you, ever, you ever seen a guitar that's not cool? No. They're all pretty cool. Actually, oh, wait. I've seen some... Are you about to throw some shade? Who are you gonna no, throw I'm not going to throw shade on anyone. <laughs> the ones that I've built... They're not cool. They're not cool. <laughs> what about Godzilla, though? Yeah, not so cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyway, back to this guitar. So, this is a... Bacon Belmont. And no, it's not the bacon that you eat, that I eat, <laughs> that I eat a lot. <laughs> um, this is a Gretsch made uh, guitar. So we're going to talk a little bit about the history. Um, bacon was actually the name of Fred Bacon, who owned the Bacon Banjo Company. Um, early on in his career, they did build a few bacon guitars. Um, they were like Knee Plus Ultra Troubadour guitars. They were made by the Martin Guitar Company, the Vega Company at first. But he was really famous for building the nicest banjos ever made. Back in 1925, he built a banjo called the Bacon and Day Knee Plus Ultra Number no. 9. It was $1,000 in 1925. Wow. Just to put it in perspective, a Ford Model T was $239 for a whole car. This banjo was a thousand dollars over That's unbelievable. almost five times what it cost. Anyway, so he had this really great banjo company. They built some guitars, mostly banjos. 1939 comes Groton, Connecticut, where it's based, the factory, the biggest, most unexpected hurricane to ever hit. Destroys the factory, floods it. A few days later, catches fire, burns all the records. Guess what? He had no insurance on the oh place. Oh my gosh. So, 1939, all that crap hits. He has to call his cousin, Fred Gretsch. He sells the company, Bacon and Day, Bacon Banjo Company, to Fred Gretsch. And uh, I think he sells it to him for a dollar because he just can't handle the bills. They buy it and start producing banjos and guitars with the name Bacon on here. And you can see they kind of use this little mother of toilet seat, uh, that, as they call it, overlay, and it's just kind of painted. Serial number on the headstock. For some reason, someone put a nice reflector on <laughs> here, who knows? One of the things that's really cool is it's a natural top. It is a flat top, it's not an arch top. It just has the floating bridge with the uh, trapeze style tail piece and a pick guard. It's kind of a transitional period, you know, guitar between arch tops and flat tops. Um, it has the uh, Bacon and Day Style 1 inlays on here, which is what the banjos came with. Um, and then maple sides, maple back, but sunburst, five piece neck, geared tuners, just a really great guitar. Really um, cool. You know, it's it's different. It doesn't sound like a flat top, but it also doesn't sound like an arch top. I'm sure when you're out there trying it out to see which one you wanted to do, you could tell it's just kind of yeah, it's a different thing in, in the middle. But anyway, Mike, you should take it away. All right, let's do it. Thank you, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that was cool. Sorry, I didn't want to just like you know he didn't know. So. <laughs> he didn't know how it goes. All right, cool. Really cool guitar though.
big sound for this guitar. Uh, let's try another piece. Definitely a unique feel. I love the neck. Let's check it out. cool guitar it's the bacon it's the bacon it's the bacon <laughs> yeah right here at norman jerry guitars you can check them all out at normanjerryguitars.com and also on instagram and facebook i'm your host michael lemo see you soon bye, bye. cool guitar cool. good yeah. job jen jen thank picked you. this one thank you thank you no worries